Hello my friends, good afternoon. Uh, once again, I'm here with a book review and this book is by Jasmine Guillory. She is the queen of the contemporary romance these days. I'm liking her novels and this is the second one I have read, actually the third one and the name is Royal Holiday. And um, this was published in 2019. I got a chance to get it from my public library and read it during this um, quarantine time while I'm home. And uh, I would like to share that um, the characters, as usual, are uh, funny, relatable. Both the main characters are above 50 years old. And um, uh, it's, it's a really fun, uh, light-hearted, romantic novel story. And yeah, you can see the donut. I'm going to eat it after the book review. So this um, is about uh, Vivian Forrest, who has been out of the country a grand total of one time. So when she gets a chance to tag along uh, her daughter Maddie's uh, work trip to England to stay a royal family member, so she couldn't refuse Vivian. She couldn't refuse her daughter and she tagged along for the trip of Europe. It's also refreshing to read about a positive mother-daughter relationship that how Maddie invited uh, and asked her mom, who is a social worker, to come with her to the business trip to Europe. So this is one nice, refreshing, positive aspect of the story also. She's excited to spend the holidays um, taking in the magnificent British sites, but what she wasn't or uh, she didn't expect was to become instantly attracted to a certain uh, private personal secretary to the queen, his charming accent and his unyielding formality. So this main character is Malcolm Hudson and uh, he has worked for the queen for so many years but he has never given those uh, personal private tours to anyone of uh, the castle. So what was it that he was also attracted uh, by Vivian the mo moment he meets her and he started uh, finding time or chances to spend time, more time with her. So this is how the love story uh, began and one thing which was a little uh, tricky or different was that how Medi, the daughter and the main character which is the mom Vivian, they got a chance to live in the uh, uh, in the queen's uh, palace or castle this was something a little uh, different or tricky but yes that's what the story is telling and then when uh, Malcolm Hudson he started giving her private tours of the uh, not only the castle but around the area this is where their love story began so overall it's a quick romantic read um, the characters are just two three it's uh, surrounded by um, the British sites castle um, light romance and uh, it, uh, it it's really nice I think it's highly recommended one more thing is that uh, I like Jasmine Guillory's uh, novels at, um, as she has all the diversity of the characters and in her um, novels, um, the female characters, all of them are always shown as smart, witty, intelligent, independent. And although the characters are not looking for or they are not on a hunt for a man, but one way or the other eventually they're always uh, they manage to find just the perfect one for themselves this is how this story is all about in these days when all the netflix and other tv dramas stories and all the movies are about young love i think this is the one which i enjoyed that even uh, giving a hope that people can find love or love can find people in their middle age and still life can be filled with beautiful surprises and um, happily ever after. This is one of those stories which you will find interesting. Uh, both the characters are above 50. Um, Vivian in this novel, she is living a dream come true life for so many. She is 54. She is a single mother and she went for the first time to the trip of Europe and met this um, person, Malcolm Hudson. He is a black, handsome uh, guy with uh, the royal formalities and his accent, charming accent, I would say. So 
this is what it is they were not expecting this relationship or the romantic love story to begin but it did and then up till the new year um, you will find out that what they will decide because she traveled from California to Europe with her daughter on a work trip and Malcolm he has always been there as a personal secretary to the Queen so how they will manage the long distance relationship how it would work this is a surprise I'm not gonna tell but as Jasmine's uh, not all the novels the ending is a happy ending so I think you all should find out from your libraries or find out where you can um, get this book and give it a read um, you will really um, enjoy it and uh, I did actually until next time take good care and I'll see you all very soon with another recipe or a book review time to eat my donut goodbye